there with your mom and dad? She looks good. Must have been really creepy in that hospital. I saw the scars on her wrist. Yeah. This one. Blood dripping from the vampire's veins. Hello. Hey, cry from the peanut gallery. I'm practicing. Good morning. morning. Good morning. Mwah. Hey, should have seen your old man last night. I was in a rare form. Moi, I got a standing earl. I got up in front of those dried up doctors and I tore that hospital apart limb from limb in two, count them, two minutes. They ate it up. They wanted more. <laughs> So you guys, um, ready to start school this morning? Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need to tell you what I expect from all of you this year. Come on, come on Rick, you're not eating. What's the matter, you got an upset stomach? I'm okay. Rick. Philip. Sorry. she needs this time alone. She's in her room. Yesterday, in his room, he told me. I, I thought he was kidding. I didn't listen to him. He only cared about her. About Lottie. Daddy. Shh, baby, shh. I wish you would have finished the job the first time. I wish you would have never come home. Philip, wait. He must have really hated us. Boy, he must have hated us. All it does is lay that pain on the broken shoulders of the survivors. I've known Rick since he used to play first base on my t-ball team. We were in the championships. It was the bottom of the ninth and the bases were loaded. And he made the most unbelievable catch. And he won the game. After that, whenever I looked at Rick, I saw a hero. I wish I would have known that heroes can be in trouble. That heroes can really be hurting inside. We haven't been as close as we used to. Not lately. We fixed a nice lunch. Thanks, Helen. Uh, but, uh... Maybe the kids, huh? Come on, kids. We've got all this good stuff in the kitchen. Can't believe all the food that people brought us. here. And yet another species will join the ranks of extinct animals due to man's careless wasting of the Earth's net. 
Hey, what are you doing? I can't watch. It's so sad. I love panda bears. Stuff look good on the picture. Yeah, we'll just turn the TV back on, all right? Why can't my friends come over? Because Mom can't handle it. How long is it going to be like this? I don't know. Hillary called. They're having this welcome party at school for all the mothers. She wants me to come bring Mama. Dad will go with you. It's for mothers. If you don't have a mom, then your dad can go. Big deal. But I have a mother. Cry, baby. Rick told you not to call me that. Just makes me cry more. Rick, 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 Rick. That's all I ever really hear. Basic diet for the world's favorite bear. But so far, although they have been able to match the food value of bamboo, the pandas have not yet developed a taste. Are you coming to school with me this morning, Mama? You said you might. I know, honey. I'm sorry. I can't. Morning. 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 <laughs> You're not going to eat any breakfast, Dad? No, I'm in a hurry. i got to get down to the hospital and check out some x-rays. You think that... Then maybe I could come down to the office after school. You know, help you out, like Rick did. I'm sorry. Rick was programming the computer. It's very technical. See, we can't take a chance on making a mistake with somebody's medical history or medication. Okay? Hey, you guys stay down. I've got him. I'm not hungry. No, you like these. You see, Rick taught me. You put the cheese in the middle. Mommy? Give me a hug. What was the first word I ever said? Light. You said, light? Every time we passed a light bulb, you tried to reach out and grab it. Was I cute? Oh, very cute. No, you look like a wet rat. Oh, she I did, did not. not. Anyway, you can't remember that far back. Oh, I saw pictures. I look like Dopey. I had big ears. No, you didn't. You were beautiful. Are you kidding? I saw pictures. No, you were all beautiful, all three of you. Was I smart? Very smart. Quick, bright, and alert. Right from the beginning. When I first held you in my arms. Looked down at you. What about me? Oh, you were a holy terror. <laughs> Especially when you learned to walk. You were into everything. I couldn't turn my back on you for a minute. I'd be in the other room changing Sarah, and you'd go in the bathroom and crawl up in the medicine cabinet and get the cold cream. <laughs> Rick was always trying to keep you out of things. Remember? Two little blackbirds sitting on a hill. Flyway Jack, flyway Jill. Let me! Alice, thin as a toothpick, hair just like a tack. Upstairs to take a bath. Alice jumped in a bathtub, pulled out the stopper plug. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my soul. There goes Alice down the hall. Poor Alice. On oh, amen. Why do we say on oh, amen instead of all oh, men? Because when Rick was little, he couldn't say amen. So he grew up saying amen. We just copied. You didn't eat your hamburger.
my sleeping pills. How many did you take? Only six. When? A couple minutes ago. How could you do that? How could you do that? Call your father and tell him to meet me at the hospital. And call Lois and tell her to come get you. Quick. Christmas. New Year's. And every single 4th of July. <laughs> Do you remember the chili bake-off? <laughs> I remember Rick asked to say he almost died. <laughs> yeah. Took to his bed for a week after that one. Turned green if you even mentioned chili after that. <laughs> I can't believe it. Happy birthday I forgot to all about it. You. I was writing checks all day. And this is the sixth. It never even dawned on me. It's my birthday. I can't believe it. Make a wish. Hurry. All right. I wish. Not out loud. No. I wish. Well, come on, blow out the candles. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> Hey, he can't tell. There are 46 candles. 46. Mm. We had to buy five packages. <laughs> <laughs> I want to thank everybody for my birthday party. You're welcome. Now, before you cut into the cake, we have a little surprise for you in the other room. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. Yeah, come Can on. I take the cake? No, bring your wine. Okay. This way, Jens. Well, thank you. All right. Right here on this stage, playing A, B, and D flat. No, Philip. Playing Aida. Playing the triumphal march from Verdi's Aida. Trumpeting sister leading the Brogan family band. Give him a big hand, everybody. <laughs> okay, you ready? Yep. One, two, three, four. Great. Oh, <laughs>